Welcome back everyone for the next part of Devil Survivor 2! In the last part, we got the information that actually our Psyduke is a uh, Septentrion. I, I never thought he would be a Septentrion. Never. Maybe a demon. Right. But a Septentrion? Holy hell. But at least we don't need to fight him since he's on our side, right? And he never betrayed us, so that's good. But uh, yeah, we also lost Yamato. Yamato has something against Saidu. I saw that clearly. I don't know about the curse on the Hutsui clan or whatever he tried to say about that because he never explained it. But he has something against Saidu. And that is why he tried to go all out at the end and even I think he wanted to destroy the terminal. Yeah, he probably tried to destroy the terminal at the end just to get in our way. Hi. Anyways, uh, let's see the cutscene, Nolan Boyd. Oh my god, the scar. Uh. Well, that's it. Creepy, right? What are you thinking? Hmm? Oh, it's not a big deal. I mean, it is a big deal, huh? I guess I've gone a little numb from all that's happened. Look, it's Polaris's black scar. What was it called? The void or something? Yeah. It spread this far, and I hear the Edogawa and Koto wards were swallowed into it. It is dead nearby. <laughs> yeah, I guess it doesn't matter at this point, but yeah, it is pretty close. It's not just Edogawa and Koto. The nothingness is expanding. People are evacuating. It's like the only things left are the parts of the city we walk around in. The evacuees are attacked by demons as they run. The people who survived this long are at their limits. Is this all because the barrier Yamato placed is gone? That's true. So we have to hurry, okay? Yeah. If we don't hurry, maybe the whole world will become nothing. I totally just killed the mood, didn't I? Sorry, my bad. We're gonna be okay, right? We've got you after all. <laughs> Let's defeat Polaris and create our new world. We can do this. Right. Sue. Are we heading over to a battle right away? <laughs> you tomorrow. <laughs> okay, wait, 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 wait. Can you save file? Right over there. I always, <laughs> always save so much, but I have to. Those battles are tough, right? You get at the terminal with your friends. Yo, man, we've been waiting for you. Let's go Indeed, over Polaris Shiny. now. We cannot begin without you, after all. Is it time? All right, then. Let's go see what this Polaris is like. Right. All right. Just a little further, huh? Uh, Daichi, what's up? We can do this. Just relax. Ah, he's just a bit... Uh, Daichi is scared again. Never mind. We're fully prepared. You may give the order when ready. We can do this. Yo, hurry it up! I don't care what we're fighting. I just don't want to see the world erased. Right. We'll be alright. As long as you guys are around, not even Polaris can scare me. I can do anything. As long as I'm with you. Nothing scares me anymore. The time is at hand. Shining One, let us create a wondrous new world. Right. Let's do this. This is it. Oh yeah! Backwards now? It's the game over screen! That was the game over screen! Yeah. 
Where the hell are we? W what the? Hey, where are we? Oh. Uh. Oh wait, 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 wait. There we go. <laughs> Almost. Almost. What the hell are you? <laughs> well done in coming here. Yet, you seem to have been taken in by Alcor's words. Ah, Polaris. Since last we were together, even the Celestial Sphere has changed. Oh man, are you that Polaris thing? I am Polaris, the administrator of worlds from atop the heavenly throne. It's your fault that our world's in ruins. We'll never forgive you. You're going down. Impudent mortals, what shall you accomplish by destroying the administrator? Well, we're going to just we're going to get a brand new world. There, side of it, Rural. That's right. We don't need you anymore. We're going to hand your throne over to Psyduke so he can create a new world. Impossible. I inherited this throne from Kokal and will be succeeded by Uray. Who the heck is Uray? The principles of the worlds are not so submissive that mere worlds can subvert them. I'm not so sure, Polaris. Humanity has potential. You will see it for yourself. Heretic Septentrion. Perhaps even your doubt was fated in the celestial desire. Thus did you test mankind, not by force, but with your heart and words. I once believed so too. I thought that my doubts were planted by a higher power. However, I see it clearly now. The actions I took were my own. They were forced upon me by no one. Oh my god, that's right. Freedom, Thank you, even Lord. for the Septentrians. I have no means of proving this. Do you still believe me? Of course I do. There. I believe you too. You've been helping us from the very beginning. I appreciate you even more now. There's no way I wouldn't trust you. Thank you, everyone. Your words give rise to such wonderful emotions in me. Humans. Now, you are no longer worth I shall erase you now. So this wait, what the hell? What are those things? We'll never let something like Polaris beat us. Get ready, everyone. Sure. Be cautious. As I told you before, I cannot defeat Polaris. Huh? And if I fall, no one can take the heavenly throne, and a new world will be impossible to create. I must survive this battle along with at least one of you. It will be difficult, but I'm sure you, or rather we, can emerge victorious. Forward! What do you mean you can... Wait... All Psyduck is defeated, all humans are defeated. Okay. Well, I uh, Psyduck is already in my party, so that's fine. Let me just quickly have a little overview. So it's a far let's get. Uh -huh. Take it alone. Uh -huh. What about you? Put a lot of proof. Strong attacks responding to the number of guardian stars. Range infinite. Wait. Oh freaking oh my god. Okay, I see, I see. Uh, you can attack me whenever you want to. Elements are not effective against you. The only thing I can hit you with is Almighty. And you have anti Almighty. Are you kidding me? So, since, uh, since, uh, strong attacks corresponds to the number of guardian stars. Are those things guardian? Yeah, well, they are called guardians. So I guess I'm supposed to kill all your little pieces before heading over there. Is that it? Okay, doesn't look so bad. It's gonna be annoying if you hit me all the time, since you <laughs> can attack from anywhere. Anything nice to crack? Oh, I can crack onto Almighty! Heck yeah! Big 
to be quite well. This is the way, actually. Oh, that's also good. I don't need a banjo, so anyone else is going to go for victory cry. Okay, so... You're not allowed to attack the Lawrence, right? That's what it says. Can you attack this Guardian stone? Can you attack the Guardians? It'd be nice to know that. Well, anyways, first of all, I need something like that. Here's a kid, it's not needed. You need something that can be... Oh my god, the match was bad. Ooh! Ooh! Let's see that. This is ridiculous, but you can get the up. Do I have somebody who could heal him up? That wouldn't cause trouble. I'm gonna take her back. Uh, I also have this guy. I'm gonna save him. I'm gonna save her. Do I still have somebody else? Did I, did I buy something? I think I bought something. Is it you? No, it wasn't you. I think I bought somebody. Yeah, I think that the that guy was it. But he's not that good. He's really not good. Okay, he's a backup user. So, one more time. All of them are magic related. Kata. Kata. Can you have <laughs> the counter barrier? Magic! Magic! <laughs> oh, okay. Okay, it's alright. It's alright. You're so fast. You should be able to, to finish them off before they do anything funny. You're going to be fine. Four stands. I don't know about four stands, but you need for five. Actually, it would be good if you had something that restores MP. Hail Faith is going to slow you down though. Maybe he would be better. Or do I have somebody else? I mean, sure, that could also work. You can freely out of the deck. Swap around as well. And I'm thinking about swapping those two over. Just so that Kada uh, is able to quickly reach all kinds of enemies. Hmm. Might be worth it. Let me check something really quickly. All right. All right. Okay. I think, I think, if I go to the right with Kada, it should be fine. I'm going to protect Kada. Uh, you guys are going to stay very close to me. We are going to go through everyone, okay? I'm not going to let any one of you guys die. And I pray to God that we are going to go through here without much trouble, okay? It doesn't seem like there are so many targets around. Except of the part that Kalawas is able to attack everything. It doesn't really look that bad. I didn't change check the oh my god the range. Okay, I cannot I cannot uh, depend on Chaos Wave. And evil flow. Actually wait I can to some regard. But not at the beginning at least. Wow! Don't you dare do that! So the first guardian is down. Give me more vitality. I need that. Polaris defense is weakened. Good. Oh, I just need to continue on with that. How hard can that be? <laughs> Wait. I defy you, Polaris. You will not stop us from creating a new world. Right. Stay on the wall. I won't back down. All my friends are here with me. I can't lose. Right. You protect them. <laughs> and Kato, administrator of the world, don't make me laugh. I'm going to crush you. Right. That's the spirit. So should I rush right in there? I think I should just rush in there. Can he reach? I think he can reach. Yep, he was in rage. Can't have that. No, can I? Uh, assassination, assassination, and pull to strike. I mean, sure, I can't really do a lot of damage against him. Never mind. <laughs> oh my god. More weakens. At least they are not moving, right? At least they are not moving. Let's go forward. Of 
Why aren't they moving? Wait. Can I take him with Eo? Yeah, I can. Okay. Eo, you go to the right side. You take care of that thing. Why aren't they attacking? I don't get it. Let's go right over here. Warp swap with him. Switch place. Wait. Can I attack this guy? Yeah, I can. Devil Flash. Grab him. The more of them I destroy, the better it is against Polaris, right? Assassination, assassination, God. Kata's strong enough, I don't need to worry about the thing. I seriously don't. And more weekends. Kata, uh, heal up the pony, please. Oh my god, he really did a better heal on him. It's ridiculous. You still choose to stand with these humans, Alcott. Then you shall perish in vain. Could it be that she's targeting Alcott all the time? Wow. I'm impressed. Wow. Bye. Oh my god! Free leap! I'm so impressed! No! We'll never survive an operation like that! It was only 800! And it didn't even hit him! But wait! It hit the same numbers of time as there are enemies. Maybe they are related somehow. I guess they are. Oh no. Wait, a physical repel. <laughs> Which just turn. Oh no! Oh no! What what am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do? Look at that! Mineram! Wow! You know, I'm just going to grab this thing and holy dance it down! <laughs> I mean infinite range, right? Infinite range. As long as I destroy the parts, it doesn't seem like it's going to cause a lot of trouble for me. And it's not like those parts are that strong either. I was fully prepared to fuse up more demons if I had to, but it seems like it's not the case. And they're not even moving. Why aren't they moving? Okay, let's see uh, this one's next. He has a lot of range, but that's alright. Let's move forward to the center. Kada! No! Kada has a bad heal! Oh my god, she kills my pony. Ah! And you hurt my Kada! Why would you hurt my Kada? There's no reason for that. Uh, there are no openings around. I need to go to the left side. Okay. Eo follows suit. Kada, you need to come back for a second. I'm gonna move upwards like that. Pull yourself up for a second. Maybe I can lure that other thing out. Samikram! Uh, yeah, Samikram that thing. Wait. What? What do you mean they can come back? What do you mean you can attack right now? Oh, this is going to be annoying. So that means basically I cannot take that much time, huh? Is that it? Well, at least uh, I'm going to send over my, my mirror later. Great. Take that thing. Let's 
Assassination, assassination. Uh, hit. There, gone. Sure, if you're gonna keep respawning, I'm just going to stand right here and do nothing. Except, uh, STTP. Should I swap over her or her? Probably her since uh, she's lower level. Yeah, for the time being at least. Wait right here. Eo, can you defeat that thing? Yes, you can. Attack. Well, at least I got ice dance on her, right? At least I got ice dance. And I still have tears. Okay. Okay. Reflect against them aren't isn't really that good. Like seriously. That's uh, uh it's, it's not that good. Need to keep that in mind. So Keda, are you alright? Do you need my help? I don't think so, but you never know. Need to get closer to that thing. Need to get closer to Eo. Sure, attack me! Attack me! That's po probably fine. I have so many heals. I have so many heals! Get rid of my. Oh my god! Okay. Sure. Sure. Freeze me! Just freeze me, I don't care. Uh, let's return that thing. Then I'm going to summon... The... Oh, let's wait. Let's wait with that. Yeah, attack me. That's good. Just attack me. You can't really attack me. I see that you only have life drain. Which is uh, kind of bad. Kind of. If I have victory cry, that would be super useful. An anti-element. <laughs> okay. Let's move closer to Eel. God! <laughs> Oh my god, those guardian stars! Why do I take forever to, in order to reach them? You know what? Get her. There, sent it over. The pony is able to help me out. Not right now, but in the next turn. Zoo! Holy dance! Holy dance! Uh, drain! You can't really do a lot of damage to this. All you have is life drain, which in fact isn't going to help. So with victory cry, should I get victory cry? Yeah, it's better than money back, that's for sure. <laughs> So, then, then we wait. She attacks me again. Oh, am I going to survive that? Titania? Okay. <sighs> oh my god. Okay, never mind. Screw that. Send the mirror over. It seems like everything else dies if they don't have something against elements. Okay? Freaking hell! Then we wait. Uh, yeah, I can't do that like that. I need to summon. Go 
a summon. Summon this guy. Let's wait. Kata. Kata waits. Now they are moving! Great! Thank you! My god! Samikram! Wait! Can I one-shot that thing? I cannot one-shot that. Summon. doesn't have range, right? It has range. Ida. <laughs> Keda. Uh. Keda. Sure. Ikata should help. Let's move over. Check. Now I'm not really that fast. Okay, I'm not really that fast, but I think Hikata should be fast. Oh, yes. <laughs> Hikata should be faster than uh, that thing. Okay. Assassination. There we go. Holy hell. <laughs> Holy hell. Okay. Great. Sure, attack him. That's perfect. That way, I can escape during the second turn. Never mind, I cannot escape during the second turn because she destroyed my escape routes. <laughs> oh my goodness. She really hates me. I have the feeling she hates me. Did I just destroy that thing? I think I did. Huh. Anyways, I need to go over there. Uh, I cannot quite reach that, so let me just go over here and pray. Next turn, I'm going to grab anti Alamite. And then. Oh, what, seriously? Am I able to attack that? I don't think so. Let's revive our escape route. Wait! Oh, stars! Freaking stars! Freaking guardian stars! Why are you responding so much? Now you drain my pee of my purple mirror! How dare you! How freaking dare you! And you have a physical weakness! From all possible weaknesses! Are you going to kill my Kata? Hikata? Hikata? <laughs> no! Kata! Kata! You survived, Kata! You survived! Okay, don't worry, don't worry. I gotcha. I gotcha. I'm gonna I'm gonna destroy the guardian again. Don't worry. Don't worry. Ice dance. Uh drain. Oh my god. Oh my freaking god! <laughs> Could I freeze it? Okay, never mind. He was able to destroy it on her own. Holy hell! Can you attack it? Can you? Please tell me that you at least can fight against those things. Okay? Tell me you can fight against guardians. Oh my god, he really can't do anything. He really cannot do anything against her. Not even the pieces. <laughs> oh god. Oh god. Well, at least I have my demons, so they can help out. I'm able to turn against Polaris. I'll have to leave the rest to you guys. Oh my god. <laughs> Kata. Oh god, Kata's going to die. There's no way. You heal him! Oh my god! Why are you so kind? Why are you so evil? At the same time! Sure, train. Thanks. 
when do I have a fire a turn? I mean, we really love the to have a turn. A single turn. One turn would be enough. Uh, assassination. It's not enough. I can't want it. But you heal me. Oh, you heal me. <laughs> Thank you very much, kind guardian. Why didn't you crit before? <laughs> Kata. Well, at least I get so many, so many level ups. So many level ups. <laughs> Okay, seriously, I need to get anti almighty, okay? I need to have that skill. It is a must. I have to have that skill. Holy dance. Triple. Oh, that hurts. That really hurts, but I got it. I freaking got it. Okay. I can't use it! <laughs> pray! Pray! Oh. And I, I, I think if I try to use possession against her, it's not going to work, right? She's destroying my escape room! <laughs> oh my god, Polaris! Come on! Don't be like this! Don't be like this! It doesn't have to be this way! Okay? It doesn't have to be this- Oh my god, she's- Kata? Yeah, of course. Kata can survive that. Damn it! How pathetic! <laughs> hey, Kata. You survived very long. You could be proud of yourself for that. Uh, heal yourself up. Wait. We need to revive our Kata. There we go. So, Kata, how do you feel? How do you, how do you feel, Kata? Yeah, attack me. That's good. That's good. I can heal. I can heal. I'm tanky. I'm tanky. Good. Good. That's not good. Please don't kill my Titania. Okay. Right, it's that thing. That thing can't do anything. Ha. So, uh, Samikra Mikato. Wait. Keda, move over to that side again. We need to wait. They're coming for us, right? Oh, wait a second. The other thing is going to uh, attack again. Oh, for the love of God. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. My Titania. My freaking Titania. <laughs> oh, come on. <laughs> Guardians. Yes. Go for Psyduk. Psyduk is tanky. My demon's arms. But Psyduk is tanky. Escape! I'll give him another chance to attack. Like hell I would give her that. Ah, that thing is back. Yo. Time to start moving again. Actually, summon. Mm, summon this guy. He has the range to still hit, right? No, he has oh my god, I shoot the wrong one. Anyways, uh, let's create a suspend data since I'm finally close enough to actually do damage, right? Let's use fairy dust as well. And attack. Oh god, Polaris. Freaking Polaris, holy dance! Triple! You don't have anti almighty. What happened with that? Oh 
There goes my Tatania. Holy dance. Holy dance. Come on. Come on. Come on. <laughs> it's so close. Oh, what is this? You would destroy me with such meager strength. Preposterous. Meager? Wait. That was pieces of her body? The whole time? Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> uh... She was holding back. That bitch! The whole time she was... Oh no! The truth is that neither of us can know the movement of the stars. I will take the throne. Absurd. You are no more than my sword. Your duty is over, Alcor. I will extinguish you. Sword? What did you do? I... I cannot move. He's stuck! Oh no! Side you can't move! I have taken your freedom. Now perish! Demons! Freaking demons! This is such BS. Now we gotta protect him and fight Polaris. Oh my god, I can't believe it. The second, the second side of got stuck, I kicked on my mute button with my knee. And I didn't even notice it during the whole fight until I reached the game over screen. Uh, yeah, we go we're gonna get to that point later. Anyways, uh, during the second phase, I noticed that the uh, Polaris doesn't really have any kind of different weaknesses or stuff that I need to get rid of in order to get close to her and the only thing I need to do is attack her I don't even need to take care of all the demons that are around us and I think during this phase I was like how do I attack her as quickly as possible to get out of this phase as quickly as possible before any of those demons around us get too close to my little Psyduke because right now I didn't even check if, uh, if he could even attack in this situation because he's stuck he's literally stuck his arms and legs are in the ground <laughs> oh my god if you think about it if I were here a little bit deeper just a little bit deeper and he would have died there's no way he would have survived inside of the floor without air. But then again, he is a Septentrian, right? He is technically a Septentrian. He could have survived. Anyway, sir, with Eva Flow and SCPP, thanks to EO, I was able to attack her in the second turn. And uh, yeah, as you can see, since she doesn't have anti almighty or any kind of special resistance, I was able to basically destroy her instantly. I even got a level up. Which is kind of nice. Anyways, so let's I head over to the third not phase. Be easily destroyed. Then I shall face you with my true strength. Oh, Polaris. When I saw that the first time, I was freaking out <laughs> because I was uh, I was very unsure how many faces there are in this game. In the last game, the other boss also had kind of like three phases. The, fa the face phase, the, the tower phase, and the approach of the tower phase when the tower was opening up, you know? Was it three or was it four? I don't remember anymore. Anyways, uh, yeah, once I saw this, uh, this body, I was worried if that thing is exactly as strong as in the first game. When it had all kinds of resistances. 
<laughs> Polaris, at last, you show your true form. I have been freed as well, so there is no need for any further trickery. Let us go forth, everyone. We shall destroy Polaris now. Of course. Yes! Sainu can move again! This really is it. We're almost there, everybody. Just a little more. So, and that is the point where I thought, oh my god, is she actually going to kill me in the first turn? Because I didn't realize that that was Eo and not Psyduke. I was screaming. I was very <laughs> stressed out. And then I saw this cutscene and was like, oh my god, this was just Eo. <laughs> oh my god, this is so ridiculous. Her right arm is able to attack the whole left side of the screen. Okay? Actually, if you really if you really pay close attention to it, the only thing that is attacking right now is her right arm. The left arm is focused around summoning demons. Uh, that's something I realized later. All the demons are just here to get in my way and in order to get in Psyduke's way. So that I can just rush over to Polaris and get rid of her. Oh my god. Ah, that's the point where I'm probably going to die soon. I can already see it. Slowly but surely we are getting there. <laughs> she is so strong in this phase. It's ridiculous how strong she is. And I didn't even realize that I could have used Evil Wave against her from there. I was able to attack from here. She wouldn't be able to attack back because her main body only has an attack range of 3 tiles. But I didn't check that. I was too worried since all her other faces had like infinite attack range. So I was sure that all of her three body parts had infinite attack range. Oh my god. Oh my god, I can't see. What did I do again? Eo? Did I try to attack with Eo? Or did I just stay behind? Then again, Eo was dead. Maybe I just summoned her. Ah, oh, no, wait. I'm actually going back to her. Or am I using her as STDP folder? Yeah, I think I'm trying to do that. Getting out to Tanya, probably try to resurrect her just to summon her over to race team. Oh my god. Kada. Kada is also coming along. Oh my god, Psyduk. Oh, Psyduk. Not going to appreciate that. And the worst part about it is... Uh, see that? I try to hide him away. I try to hide Saidu. I, I put him as far away as possible and then she summons a demon very close by. And then the right arm attacks. Wait for it. I think that's the point where... Yeah, yeah. I see my... I see my dead coming. See that? See th Oh my god, the extra turn, dead bot, and... Ah... Uh, yeah, if you, if you do this path, you need to give it null physical. Anyways, back to the sounds. So, okay, and back we are. Uh, as you can see, I changed up my party. I fused up a few new demons. I gave Al Saiduk a few new skills, like until most null physical, because of his right uh, rather. Is it the left or the right part? His right part, okay? I don't want to die because of physical hits again, so that's why he's carrying no physical. As well as livestream in order to boost up his HP to the absolute maximum. He also has a very, very resistant free leap Fenrir, just to make sure that if he gets attacked, he can always escape after the second hit. There's no way I'm going to allow her to attack him twice. And uh, my Rakta is a little bit in danger, but that's okay. I just created this suspend data. Now that everyone is basically alive, Kader's really far ahead. He should be able to attack really soon. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Yeah, uh... Would you be so kind to heal up your little Rakta? Just to make sure that she doesn't die. And we're going to wait right here. Now the thing is... Uh, 
I'm not really sure. It seems like her attack range isn't that big. That means as long as I stay out of this range, if I have an evil way user, like, uh, do I have one? Or is it dead? I think it's probably dead. Anyways, uh, now that I have Kada right here, Kada's probably going to die soon. But I can at least attack once, right? Do I have somebody who could be? I cannot heal. But I have reflect on three of my users, so it should technically be fine. Assassination. Assassination. Tetrakan. In the off chance that Baron is faster. Come on! Come on, Kada! I know he can do this! One, two, three! Because I learned that this attack is physical. But somehow, that stupid thing can attack twice! <laughs> oh my god! There, let's do it again. Let's do it again. Triple assassination! Go, Kada! Rip it apart! <laughs> Rip that thing apart! Okay? And we can attack again! We can attack again! Okay? Okay. Okay, da. I always knew you were the boss. I always knew it. Tetra Khan. You're not going to survive the second round if he hits you again with the same attack. But maybe he kills himself? Good! See that? All you need in order to defeat that thing is making sure that Alcido has something against physical and you have reflect against her very strong physical attacks. That is all I needed! That is all I needed! <sighs> With that, we reach the final. You truly intend to destroy me, to attain your naive fantasy. You are fools! Sleep, Master of Memories. The world will have a new administrator. Be gone! Faint one, Alcor. You will take up the heavenly throne and weave man's history? This is not mankind's world. Much will be lost if you go down humanity's path. <sighs> Perhaps. But I wish to see where their path leads. I am different. I am not like you. And there she goes. No more Polaris. No more Polaris. We are free. And now, and now our little Psyduke is going to be king. Right? Wait, 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 wait. Okay. The top screen always surprises me. Do I need to go back to the... Yeah, okay. So! Hey, does this mean... Yep, she's gone. And it's all over. You have won a new world with your own hands. <laughs> yes! That was awesome! We did it! Oh, the, huh? the thing is back. What's that? Look, something's appeared. It's the Heavenly Throne. Vega, Thuban, and Kokop once sat upon it. Urai would have been next. The occupant is responsible for managing the world and may use the power as he sees fit. The Heavenly Throne? Then why don't you sit down? You should hurry! Right! But then again, if that is a throne, why was she underneath it? She was carrying it around like a crown. Hmm. Tell me, Shining One. Would you really have me sit on this throne? Is this the right thing to do? Having second doubts here? Of course! Hmm. Oh my god! I see. Then I won't ask again. Do you really think I would have farmed for stronger demons if I didn't want to doubt, huh? Oh, Psyduke. And there he goes. The history of man is one of war. Fear of one's fellows leads to bloodshed. But you, you are different. 
I'm glad I put my faith in you and your potential. Thus do I gladly ascend as the foundation of your new world. Oh? Huh? Hey! What does that mean? Wait! I'm counting on you! Go, Psyduck! Create a new world! Huh? Like promise! Wait, the top screen! Oh my god! Do I need both or do I need the top, bottom? Mm? Can't tell. Okay, it seems like the top screen is obsolete. <laughs> okay. Oh. What is this place? In your beginning, Daichi. It's the new world. Indeed. This is your new world. You will no longer be bound by anything. That voice. Is that Psyduk? Where are you? I am before you. I am now the world. All that shall be with you. Well, thank you. I should be thanking you, Shining One. You cast away my doubt and gave me light. I have no physical form now, but I need none. This world requires no administrator. Now, go forth. Goodbye, my children. I look forward to seeing where your potential takes you. He's really gone. That idiot. If this is the end, he should have at least... Hey, it's not the end, Daichi, and you heard him, right? He's part of this whole world. But I will miss him. His we'll miss jokes. You. His spooks. Without you around. Every time when he surprises us with his random teleportation, or when he kidnapped Daichi for a second. Hmm? Oh, the day's breaking. <laughs> Beautiful. It's the best sunrise I've ever seen. Me too. Yeah. Psyduk says he's the world now. So we'll make him one amazing world. Just you watch, Psyduk. Just you watch. My god, this is so pretty. This is so pretty. Worth the grind. Absolutely worth the grind. The cur- Whoa, wait! Whoa, 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 whoa! Ho, ho! The curtain of mankind's previous history has been drawn, and a new era has begun. There's no knowing what this new future holds. However... Hmm? Mankind will go on as a species with untaped, limitless pos possibilities. As they embrace the day, victory in their hearts. Too bad that we can't share that with Ronaldo and Yamato. Can't understand those guys. Why did they have to throw away their lives like that? Near the end! I mean, I could... Just track them. They could have just rejected us, okay? They could have just rejected us, but they didn't. <sighs> and now we see the credits. But, uh, well, I, I'm not going to make my credits speech yet, because there's still much for us to see. I mean, three more endings, and a whole new arc, which probably also have a few endings. <laughs> oh god, this, this project is going to take a while longer. 
I'm hoping I to look forward to that. But I'm going to make a cut right here. Just to see if there's another cutscene right at the end. So... Is there another cutscene right at the end? Or... Am I just going to get thrown out like usual <laughs> to the ending screen where I can create... Wait, wait, whoa, wait, there is a cutscene! It's my phone! I see her? Oh my god, another dead video? Please don't! Wait. You now have a new world. Let's survive. Oh! Well, nice to see that they are still around. And now I can create my own little clear data. I'm gonna save right away here. There we go. Now, in the next part, I'm going to meet you guys again on the 6th day Friday, around 23 hours. Right? Yeah. On the day when we are allowed to decide which path we're going to take. Because there are still three more endings for us to see. I hope you're going to look forward to that. Until next time! Bye bye